Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. The live entertainment industry has been one of the hardest hit across the nation during the COVID-19 pandemic. Venues across the country took a stance tonight to bring attention to their struggles. Central Oregon joined the party tonight. Alec Nolan joins us now with more. Alec? Lee, Central Oregon got to Live Events Coalition a little late, but tonight they participated in a nationwide effort to bring support to live event workers. The hashtag red alert made its presence felt at Ben's Tower Theater. The first ones to close, and now they fear they'll be the last ones to open. The live entertainment industry is bleeding because of the pandemic, and they fear they might be gone forever if change doesn't come. Last week, Portland Live Events workers issued a call to action, light our city's red. Ben's Tower Theater on Wall Street is helping answer that call. This rallying cry for September 1st is part of a national effort to raise awareness for the plight of live events workers and advocate for the Federal Restart Act. The Restart Act is a bill that would extend the Paycheck Protection Program established to support small businesses with fewer than 500 full-time employees that suffered a decline in revenues of at least 25 percent. More than 80 percent of Oregon event businesses and workers have lost all income due to COVID-19. We work in the background by definition, so we're invisible. And this whole process since this started, we were the first to close and we knew there was a problem by late February. Um, this whole process has been as much about just saying, hi, we're here. Oh, well, how many of you are there? Um, 12 million. Ben's Flip Flop Sounds and Tower Theater joined forces tonight to show support for all the workers struggling throughout the industry. Workers like Courtney Latham are facing the same economic troubles as so many others, but they feel like their industry isn't receiving the same support from Washington. We're kind of being forgotten about a little bit. We can't pivot. There's no way to do an event in some sort of a new way um, that is, makes sense. And so while a restaurant can do curbside, while a grocery store can change directions and do increased spacing, we're left without any help uh, and any way to move forward. The Live Event Coalition says this is just their opening act to bring awareness. On September 22nd, they plan on Oregon taking a concentrated effort with hashtag red alert all across the state. Without any financial assistance, it might just be the final act for the industry. The Live Events Coalition says if you want to show your support, send the red alert hashtag on social media September 22nd. Lee, back to you.